be sure to check out the links to the tools and products that I use daily in the description below. And uh, any purchases you make from Amazon through those links, I'll get a small commission from uh, at no cost to you. I'm going to see if I can explain this to you without it being too difficult. This is your stator assembly, not your starter, your stator. This is your pulse coil. Okay? The stator. Pulse coal. This is what is considered to be your flywheel. These inside here are magnets. They rotate like this. around this and as it rotates around this it creates a magnetic field which produces ac electricity okay now see this little spot here on top of your flywheel that's your timing port Okay, and that, as it rotates, just like this, okay, every time it hits that magical spot, the pulse coil, the tip on the pulse coil picks it up and reads it. And it sends a signal to your CDI box and your CDI box tells your coals when to fire you got me okay now I'm gonna throw another kink in here this is your starter your starter when it turns it comes out and makes contact with your flywheel, turning your flywheel. It, the starter turns this way, turns your flywheel this way. 
okay? All of these right here are very magical. There's a spring inside there that is very magical. You don't want to lose those. That keeps everything just right. Okay, you got an O-ring that's in there. That's very magical. It keeps things dry inside there. Now, if you look and see, I got lots of rust around the outside of my flywheel. The outside of the flywheel is not that bad. Okay, now you see down here, see down here, I got another I got another timing mark right here. One of them's for your number one cylinder. The other one's for your number two cylinder. Okay. Ooh, you should smell this. Okay. Now, what my... My concerns is not the rust here on this part. My concerns are that piece that's missing right there. And all of this stuff right here that's down in there. And all of the little bitty pieces of metal inside here. Now, I just rotated the engine 180 degrees. Give me the timing point. All right. It don't look so bad. So I'm just wondering if I can clean that up. On the other side with some sandpaper and it worked. Just wondering. Or should I buy a new flywheel? Just turned it back to where it was at. I'm gonna look at this. 